Hey guys! Today's video is about the uh, Olympus EM1 Mark II and I will compare the rolling shutter uh, in comparison with the EM1 Mark I version. Video starts after my intro. Have fun! So, for comparing the rolling shutter I have a small iPad app running on my iPad here. I will show it to you. And this app uh, shows a lot of dots, a line of dots running from the left side to the right side of the screen. And I will then take a photo with the new EM1 Mark II and with the EM1 Mark I. And the dots will run with a certain speed through the through the monitor and like this I can compare the rolling shutter how fast it is read out over the over the size of the screen. The disadvantage of the electronic shutter is that the sensor is read out line by line. This happens from top of the sensor to the bottom and takes comparatively long. The longer time this takes, the more distorted are objects that move through the picture, independent of the actual shutter speed. This image shows the dots that pass along the screen within 0.5 seconds. As reference, a shot taken with the mechanical shutter of the EM1. And now the picture with the electronic shutter of the EM1. It is very obvious that the dots are shifted to the right three times because the sensor couldn't be read out fast enough and the dots have moved already to the next column despite the shutter speed being fast enough to freeze the picture. And here we have the picture with the electronic shutter of the EM1 Mark II. According to Olympus, the readout speed is four times faster than of the original EM1 and takes about one sixtieth of a second. That's why in this case we have no visible rolling shutter effect. Of course the effect isn't completely gone with the new model, but a lot less obvious. This car moves around 70 km per hour. You can see the effect is not very severe. And here the rotor blades of the starting aircraft look pretty good as well. So it looks that the uh, electronic shutter from the EM1 Mark II is now a lot better than the shutter from the EM1. And that's why I think we will see in the future a lot improvement in this sector and maybe soon we will see the first global shutter in the camera industry from Olympus or maybe from another manufacturer. So thanks for watching the video and the next video I will make is about the, the continuous autofocus or the autofocus system of the EM1 Mark II. Bye bye.